Gracias. So yesterday was kind of a bust, but I'm actually out here in the similar area about to look at another apartment that is only 380,000 pesos per month, so a lot cheaper, same area. A really unfortunate turn of events. I could not, for the life of me, find this apartment. I'm in the right area uh, where the GPS told me to go, the right street, even the right building, but I could not find the unit in the building. I swear it just does not exist. And I don't have Wi-Fi on my phone or any connection, so I couldn't really uh, ask anybody or, or look on the maps. I asked a bunch of people around here, like, oh, where is this, where is this, and they kind of point me in the right direction, but could never exactly find where it was. So I'm on my way back to the hostel right now. I need to get checked out of the hostel, move to another hostel for a couple of days, and uh, get on the Wi-Fi and talk to the owner and say that, sorry, I didn't show up. I couldn't find the place. All right, so here is the scoop. I'm back in my hostel here in El Centro, which is about a 30 minute transit, taking a couple of the metro trains here. So I got back to the hostel, talked to the lady that is trying to rent me the room, and I was really apologetic, and she's like, where were you? I was waiting for you. And I said, I couldn't find it. Was it this address? She said, no, it's this address. And so um, she rented out that room, but she said she has another one. And I said, okay, you want to meet me again in 45 minutes? And she said, okay. So all my stuff is packed up. It's time for me to check out of this hostel anyway. I'm going to not book another hostel. Maybe I can just get in to uh, this room here, like, right now. We'll see. And if not, then I'll figure something out. But, uh... Here we go, round two. So I did like it. I did like that place. Unfortunately, it just had a single bed and it was a really small room. I just like to have a little more room and the Wi-Fi was a little slow. So I'm gonna look a little bit more. I really don't have too high of standards when it comes to finding a room, but a couple necessary things. The Wi-Fi needs to be pretty good just because I do spend a lot of time uh, uploading, downloading, streaming, all that kind of stuff. So we're gonna go find another hostel. Hola. Hola. Tengo una reservación. ¿A nombre de quién? Uh, Marshall Powell. Marshall. Sí. ¿En qué página la hiciste? Hostel World. You didn't find God in Jerusalem. I'm going to have to keep looking. Oh, here's our question to the airport. And so the search continues. Um, I'm just gonna wrap up this video right now. I'm in the new hostel. I booked this for a couple nights. I'm gonna keep looking online and I'm in the area that I really like, which is Laureles. And so I hope I can maybe explore around here over the next few days and, and find some places. I asked the guy at the front desk if he knew of anywhere, any place to rent, and he said that there is a, a building about a block over that is renting places for about 600,000. Honestly, since I just saw that one for 380, I'm on the hunt for something a little cheaper than 600000 
But if you like this video, you should definitely check out this video, which is more of Medellin and El Poblado, which is a really, really popular neighborhood around here, and some of the hostels there, and some of the food prices there. All right, guys, I will see you next time.